come in. Yeah, please come. Good morning. Good morning. Please take your seat. Everybody. So, you are from uh, Bellary. Yes, madam. So, what is uh, Bellary famous for in Karnataka? Bellary is famous for its heritage like Hampi Mill. Then it is uh, iron ore. And uh, from the point of irrigation, we have a Tungabhadra Dam. And from the point of culture, we have a Burrakata, Irama. So, diff in different way, Bellary is famous. Now. So, you said it is famous for Hampi, is not yes, it? So, what is the history of Hampi? Hampi? Any idea? Can you tell us something more about Hampi? Hampi was the capital city of the Vijayanagara Empire. Now. And uh, it is considered as a world heritage site on in the Karnataka. And it is known for its architectural marvelous. For example, indo sarsanic architecture present in the Hampi and the stone chariot is also present in the Hampi. And uh, we, we can see that we can, we can hear that uh, music is coming out <coughs> from the stone mill. So, okay. in all these aspects, Hampi is famous not only for uh, India, Madam, but for Volvo it is famous. Madam. Any kings you famous for establishing in the Vijayanagara Empire, you can name some kings. There were many kings famous for their uh, their administration, Madam. For example, Devaraya one. After that, Krishna Devaraya is famous. So there were many kings were famous for their administration and their uh, prosperity. What were they famous for? Say Krishna Devaraya. What was he known for? He is known for his uh, secularistic in nature, and uh, he promoted a different uh, literature work. For example, Tamil, Kannada, Telugu, and also he uh, he promoted though he is a Vaishnavite. He promoted Shaivism and the Dasa cult has begun in his era. What is the difference between Vaishnavite and uh, Shaivism? Vaishnavism and Shaivism? Vaishnavism more related to the Vishnu. Okay. Shaivism related to the Shiva. Medal. What is the optional? Kannada literature. Kannada literature. Okay. Hmm. So, you have been working as a PSI. Yes, madam. Isn't it? Yes, madam. So, why do you want to get into the civil services? Madam, I can work in a police sub inspector well with more satisfaction, just it is aspiration, I can reach more people if I get into the higher services. But as far as my experience is concerned, we can serve to the people wherever we go and in whichever, in whichever post we can, we can serve them. It is aspiration and uh, if we go to the higher level, we can reach more number of people, we can change a, a, a remarkable change in the society. Madam. What remarkable change you want to make? I want to make a change. Uh, in a district business. If I Suppose you are posted as a DC in a backward district. Yes, madam. What change you would like to bring about in such a district? Madam, I strongly believe health, education and infrastructure are the basic needs for the change of the any society. If we provide, if I become a DC, I will provide health, education, water, women empowerment. I strongly believe women empowerment is the core principle of the Indian development. Do you mean to say so far our country has not taken care of these sectors. Madam, we have finished 75 years of independence. True, madam. Are the health, education, women empowerment not been taken care of by the earlier governments or the present government? No, madam. Uh, if we see the 75 years of our history, we have reached many milestones and many visionaries that have contributed to the Indian welfare. But it is my small portion of work. We, I want to uh, add my effort into the India's glory and India want to become a Shaguru. Okay.